Hi guys, and welcome to episode 10 of Geography Explained Online, all the way up to number 10 now. And we have a very special skill for you today. What skill are we doing, sis? Well, special, maybe, but bearings is very what the fine. skill is. So we know how to, to tell north, east, south, west from each other. We know direction. We need something a bit more specific because you might get asked rather than a direction to figure out a, well, a direction using bearings. So we're gonna talk about what they are and what they're used for. Awesome, so we'll do this on a whiteboard. We're also gonna show you some past HSCs and how to find bearings on a map. Let's get to it. West side. Okay, so what are bearings? Bearings are just a more accurate way of doing direction. Okay, just trying to be more specific. So if someone was to ask you, if you were here, to travel in a north easterly direction, then really anywhere kind of in this vicinity here, that whole bit is really northeast. So there's this margin of error here. We're not very specific when we say northeast. So we need something a bit more specific. This is where bearings come in. Bearings use the premise of being uh, using a circle, right? So there's 360 degrees in a circle. So rather than thinking about it just in a four different directions, we think about it in a whole circle. So up the top is zero degrees, and as you go around the circle, you get to 90 degrees, a quarter, 180, halfway, 270, and of course, 360 back at the top. So in this sense now, if someone was to ask you to go northeast, not very specific, but if someone asked you instead of going northeast to go on a bearing of 45 degrees, you'd get your protractor out, you could measure to the, you know, to the degree exactly where that was, probably about here. So then, instead of just going northeast, if someone was to say, go the, this place there to that place there is a bearing of 40 degrees, you'd be able to go directly to it without missing it because you're being much more specific, specific than just a direction of northeast. Thanks for that, Mr. Sizio. So we've got a work example here that we're gonna go through and we're looking at this topographic map on this broadsheet and you've been given two points. So we've got a point here at Shoal Bay and a point over here at Carrara Hill. And what we're gonna ask is the bearing from Shoal Bay, so starting at Shoal Bay to Carrara Hill. The first thing I always tell my students is to draw a clear line between the two points. So if this is in your HSC, make sure you're drawing all over your broadsheet, draw a line that connects them, and that's gonna make the next step a lot easier. Now, Shoal Bay is our zero point. So you're gonna put your protractor right in the middle here, and it's great at this point because it's on an actual line. So you can line it up to make sure that if we look up here, we've got zero degrees, um, straight above and what we're going to do now is come all the way around working in a circle until we get to the point where the line we've drawn intercepts our protractor. So as you can see here the uh, bearing from Shell Bay to Carrara Hill is about 253 degrees. Thanks so much for watching guys that was bearings a bit more specific way of doing direction. Um, we will have a new video out next week not sure what that's we'll just is. wing it we'll figure it out sometime on Tuesday and just just do a top of a head like it's worked so far. Well, let's just keep doing that. Make sure you check us out on Instagram at geography underscore explained underscore online. We have merch. We, yeah, have, we, stickers. we have stickers. If you want a sticker and you're on Instagram, give us a shout out. Come get a sticker. It's all good. Also, make sure you like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit that notification bell so when we do put out new videos, you will be the first to see. Hashtag notification, notification squad. squad. Represent. Thanks so much for watching, guys. See you next week. West side. Try, try and do the intro with me doing this. Hi guys, welcome to episode 10 of Geography Explained. <laughs> <laughs> <Not mine. laughs> we're just checking what episode we're up to. Is it 10? Someone we film so much content. So much content. So much. That's it. There are, oh. oh. <sighs> Did you forget this? No, we were just filming. Oh, that's right. You just ruined everything. Sorry. It's all right. Anywhere in this whole vicinity is, is Northwest, right? Damn it. <laughs> <laughs>